I mean, it's, it is crazy. It's like, how did the same environment produce people who diverge so dramatically? And right. it's, it's that whole nature versus nurture question too. Like there, even though I think I'm very different than my brothers, mm -hmm. there are certain things like our sense of humor that like right. nobody else is exactly the same way. So it is interesting also to note those places of overlap. The ways that it still comes out, no matter like how you grow apart or together, whatever it is. Like I see that with my brother too, where we'll just have a moment where we'll both laugh at something. And I'm like, I know that this is just because we totally. shared life, you know, for 18 years. Yeah. Uh, and is there one sibling sort of that you connected to the most? I, I think... Well, I sometimes joke that this book could only have been written by a Varya. Um, if right. For people who haven't read the book, Varya is the one who receives, this isn't much of a spoiler because this is in the first like 30 or so pages. She receives the furthest out date of death. She's told that she'll live until her 80s, but she winds up living with the most fear and anxiety and um, kind of paralysis. And she's a worrier. And I, and I, am a warrior and I wish that I weren't, <laughs> but you know, it's, it's one of those things that, you know, letting go, accepting, not 